In this video, I'm gonna go over the unit of measurement that is used by all nations for air and sea travel, and they call it a nautical mile. And the speed when then distance is a nautical mile is called a knot. So we're gonna basically try to find out how much is one nautical mile. Okay, and the nautical mile is based on the like you know the circumference of the earth, and let's say this is the surface of earth and this this angle made by this arc which is a longitude arc uh, on the surface of earth with the center is 90 degree and the definition they say one minute of latitude along any line of longitude is basically uh, one nautical mile okay so like as we said this is a 90 degree angle and if we divide this arc into 90 equal parts that means this one part over here is one degree okay and and one degree one degree is equal to 60 minute or we can say one minute of an arc is equal to 1 over 60 of a degree okay so 1 60th part of this section if this is 1 degree so 1 60 of that degree is 1 minute and that 1 minute is called a nautical mile okay so a minute of an arc on the planet earth is one nautical mile so basically this one minute is one nautical mile okay so one minute of uh, latitude along any longitude line is called a nautical mile and uh, one nautical mile if we look into let me write nm let's say nm nautical mile is equal to 1852 meters okay and which is equal to 1.852 kilometer and if we look into miles one nautical mile is equal to 1.1508 miles or in terms of feet 6076 feet is equal to one nautical mile so that distance on the surface of earth okay and the knot so knot is a unit of measure for a speed when the distance is measured in nautical mile you know so basically if you are traveling at a speed of let's say if you're traveling at a speed of Uh, one nautical mile per hour then you are basically traveling at a speed of one knot okay so that's the definition of speed in terms of nautical mile so one nautical mile per hour is called one knot all right i hope this will help you guys just uh, watch it and i maybe you already know it so just watch the video and share with your friends and please subscribe to the channel and if there is any problem like any numerical problem just uh, leave a comment and i'll try to solve the problem for you guys thank you for watching the video have a good day bye bye